We've got neighbours, a real pain in the backside, always causing trouble. Now they've put up a CCTV camera, and it's pointing over my private property. That's not legal, is it? Right, well, first of all, um, when you say pointing over, is he opposite you? Is he next to you? No, it's over their front door, and it's pointing over my private driveway. So you're opposite him? They've done it just to be awkward. Are, are, you, op- not are you opposite people. him? No, side by side, two different properties next to each so other. You're next to each other. So, so it's kind of, uh, it's in front of the front of his house, and it's kind of pointing to the side and twisting around to catch your front door. Yes. Right. Is there is there a fence between you? No. So is no, it, it's just open driveway. Can, it have, by can side. it have any function other than irritating you? I mean, could it be there for the prevention well, or detection of crime, which is what CCTV cameras are normally there for? Well, at the end of the day, it's the neighbours that irritate me because they're just bloody awkward. They're always causing trouble and doing things to irritate people. And they're really annoying the other neighbours the other side of me. Now they put these cameras up, that are looking over my private property. Right. Um, just answer the question, though, Sonny, please. Uh, could uh, could that those cameras be used for the prevention or detection of crime? <laughs> I don't know. Their excuse is that it's watching a neighbour across the road because it might hit their car, but it's not even pointing at the neighbour over the road, it's pointing at me. Yeah, and um, have you... Presumably you've asked them to move it and they've refused. No, I haven't spoken to them yet. Well, how, do you know what their excuse, how do you know what their excuse is if you haven't spoken to them? Well, I just don't know. I just don't. I, th- I don't think. I mean, you you, you, you gave a very I mean, specific yeah. answer to my last question. Their excuse is that it's pointing at a different neighbour to stop the car being hit. How do you know that if you haven't spoken to them? Yes, uh, that's what they told me. So, so you have spoken to them. Yes. Right. So, so having not spoken to them, at did the you... neighbours over the road, it's pointing at my house. Did, next door. Did, when you spoke to them, did you make that point? Did you ask them to move the camera? I haven't asked them yet. Okay. Do you think that might be a sensible first thing to do? Yes. If I talk to the housing authority who own their house... Why don't you talk to the neighbour first and ask them to move the camera? Yes, will do. But in the end, if they don't move it, will the housing authority tell them to remove it? No, the housing authority won't be interested. Uh, The information commissioner's office won't be interested. They don't get involved in disputes uh, with cameras between neighbours on their website. Your only option would be to bring a claim in the civil court uh, claiming they're infringing your privacy, to which their defence would be it's for the prevention or detection of crime, which is the standard defence and it works. If you can prove to the judge that it couldn't possibly be for the prevention or detection of crime and that it's only there to annoy you, you'll get an injunction to require them to move it. Good luck with that. If I were you, I'd just ask them nicely.